Welcome to a CAD designing. This is the SOLIDWORKS 3D modeling, exercise number 40. We make this 3D model in minimum and simple steps. Let's start. Start the part modeling. We will make a 3D model help of this diagram. First, we analyze the diagram and decide the steps. At the start, we will select the right side plane for sketch. We make this complete sketch of this view. Then extrude them one by one. Then make another support rib. Make these holes for cutout. Fillet the required edges and complete the 3D model. Let's start modeling. Select the right side plane for the sketch. Take a corner rectangle tool and start draw from origin point. 33 millimeters height and 290 millimeters width of the rectangle. Then we make this cylinder profile. Take a circle tool and draw a circle approximately above the rectangle. Diameter 100 millimeters. Draw one more circle with the same center of diameter 60 millimeters. Take a smart dimension tool. Set the dimension between top line of rectangle and circle is 70 millimeters. Then set a horizontal dimension between this vertical line and circle is 180 millimeters. Take a line tool. This time we make this support rib profile. Draw approximately from this circle. Like this way. Horizontally straight to the left side, then straight vertically up to this rectangle. Take a smart dimension tool and give the dimension between these two vertical lines is 60 millimeters. Then give the dimension to this vertical line is 70 plus 30 equals 100 millimeters. Once, take a line tool and draw a straight vertical line from this quadrant point of circle to rectangle. Take fillet tool and set the radius 30. Select this corner. See the preview and click on OK. Now take a circle tool and draw the circle of diameter 25 millimeters with the center of this filleted arc. Our sketch is done. Go to Feature tab and select Extruded Boss Based Tool. First, we select this base for Extrude with the Mid Plane option. Select this base profile and select the Mid Plane option for Direction 1. Enter the extruding value 100 millimeters. Confirm the preview and click on OK. Select the Sketch 1 from Boss Extrude 1 feature. Take a Extrude Boss tool and this time we select the cylindrical profile for Extend. Once we select Midpoint option for Direction 1. Enter the Extrude value 112 mm and click on OK. Once again, we select Sketch 1 and take to Extrude Boss based tool. This time we select remaining profile of supported rib. Notice here, the rib is placed on side face of base plate. But, we make sketch at middle plane. So, we have to offset our sketch plane up to this surface. Select offset option from here and set the 50 mm offset distance. Now our profile is extruding from this edge. Here we need to switch the extruding direction from here. Put the extrude value is 25 mm. Confirm the preview and click on OK. Here we want to make one more rib support for another side. Select this boss extrude 3 solid. Take a mirror tool and select the right side plane for mirror axis. Confirm the preview and click on OK. We built successfully another supported rib. Now we make this holes on base plate. Select this face for sketch. Take a circle tool and draw a circle with the tracking reference of this midpoint of the edge and draw a circle of diameter 25 millimeters. 
Similarly, draw a circle of diameter 25 mm to another side. Take a smart dimension tool and set the dimension from this edge of the circle is 36 mm. Do same for another side circle. Set dimension 36 mm. Go to Future tab and select Extruded Cut. Select through all option for direction 1. See the preview and click on OK. Take filleting tool and take approximate radius value 3 mm. And select the filleting edges as shown in diagram. Our 3D model is completed. Apply any appearance for this model. As you like or as per your requirement. I hope all steps are you understood. Keep practice to make this model. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.